Hi guys, it's Belle here and it is time for Marguerite Miller Monday and it is week 24. Don't forget to use this hashtag to check out what everyone's doing. Just do the different week um, so you can remove the 24 and put 21 or seven uh, to see what everyone's doing here and on Instagram and also I have linked Marguerite Miller's YouTube and her Etsy where you can purchase the digital prompts from down below so let's get started something from the recycle bin so um, I've got this out this is some new cat food we were trying for our older cat um, and I just want to use this cat because isn't it beautiful? A bottle or glass. I have a page from a Daphne's diary and we have both kind of glass vase as well as these pink glasses. A piece of wrapping paper. So I have this little piece that I've used a few times in these collages but it's in my collage box so I want to keep using it until it's gone. A favourite food, so out of a vintage book, I cut out this picture of raspberries. Text in a different alphabet, so I have this um, page here that I found in my stash. And bonus three or something, so I've got three hearts that are either single, but I also thought I might just cut this into three. That's what I might do. So let's get started. First thing I want to do is cut out this absolutely adorable cat. Can't make too much of a fuss of her. Even though she's not real, my cats might get jealous. <laughs> Especially my older cat, Topaz. She is so used to... She's such an affectionate cat and she's so used to having a lot of affection that she can get a little bit jealous if we're giving affection to the others <laughs> like if I'm talking to the other my two little kittens um, or giving them love suddenly Topaz often runs from somewhere and meows at me as if to say right I'm here now so you don't have to pay attention to them anymore mother <laughs> give me snugs um, so well you know, she's 12 now, so if she wants snugs, she can have snugs. Um, the ears can pop over the top. I don't know where I'm going to put it yet. So, I cut out part of the raspberry. Uh, we've got this from the magazine. So, I'm just going to kind of cut it down and then see where I can place it and all that kind of thing. Because right now it's too big and I don't need all of it. I'm thinking, <laughs> wouldn't it be like, honestly, if my cats were sitting next to a glass like that, I'd be like, oh dear, <laughs> have to move it. Because they'd probably be up to, um... well, one of them's particularly clumsy, so she might just knock it off just because. Um... But yeah, cats can also be very mischievous, I want to say. That's what I want to say. I'm going to put the cat in front of the raspberries like that. We can have the glass moved over. And then I need to find a space for the text. If I rip a bit more of this. So yeah, it does make me laugh, I have to say. When... <laughs> When my beautiful topaz is just comes running, <laughs> um, it's like yes, you have fuss too. We still love you. Um, she just wants to make sure that we understand that she is the centre of this household. <laughs> oh dear me does make me laugh. I don't need all of that, so I'm just going to rip that. I don't really want this bit on here. So I'm going to kind of centre this a little bit here. A lot of it might be hidden behind the cat, but I'm hoping we see some of it. 
so it should come together quite quickly today which is good I don't even know if I've got this the right way up I'm assuming so because I'm looking at where the page the number on the page was and um, kind of going with that but I apologize if this is not the right way up I feel like that definitely needs to go on there okay so I will do this so this is a sunny day with a cat in the garden now I don't have a cat like this I've never had a cat of this colouring it almost looks excuse me either Burmese or Siamese something like that um so yeah but I do have a raspberry bush in my garden that I have had for years it was gifted to me and I have since gifted lots of its little offshoots to other people um so yeah I do have a raspberry bush I love raspberries guys especially fresh raspberries I'm sorry and, and I know how privileged I am to have a garden um, and to be able to grow fruits and things in it. Um, but I, there's nothing better, I don't think, guys, than going out in your garden or your little patch of land or even just a pot or something and grabbing some fresh fruit or veg Um and I love when the raspberries are in season to just go and pick the raspberries for um, whatever I'm, do you know what, I'm going to round that a little bit, whatever I'm eating that day, um, you know, to top on top of my cereals or, you know, my granola and stuff or to make a dessert from. I just, I love raspberries. Yeah, little cat. Maybe we can move it over a little bit. I don't want to be too much in front of that glass. Yeah. So my cats definitely love to sit in the garden, or they did. These new girls, no. Um, we don't let them out. But, yeah, our old cats used to love sitting under the raspberry bush because they can get some shade or under the apple tree um, because, again, they can get lots of shade. Okay, I'm not sticking that bit down because that has to go over the cat now lots of glue there that's fine these are old scissors that I keep for using with these but yeah this is actually from a vintage kids dictionary book okay oh do you know what I haven't used yet I haven't used any of this wrap no, I can add that that's fine I can add it in places I can also use it as my tab Oh, that's what I need to think about as well, where the tab's going to go. So I'm going to do that to the cat. I've got this kind of white marble tab. I think it's going to go here. I'm going to stick this on now because I don't know if the cat is going to go over the top of it slightly. So if I stick it on where I want it, because I'm trying to stagger where the tags go. Um, so that when they're in my box, it's easier to see the number. Do, do, do. Okay, let's put you on there, kitty. Meow. Oh, just look at that face. It looks like it's saying, what? I am sitting next to this glass completely innocently. I don't know what you're thinking I'm going to do whilst I'm just going to stretch my paw out ever so gently and possibly knock it off. <laughs> oh, that's one of the things I love about cats. They're just a little bit mischievous. Well, actually, they can be a lot mischievous. Um, okay, so let's take some of this wrapping paper. 
I love this wrapping paper. I was just thinking of adding like a bit somewhere. You know, sometimes you just have to get a bit creative with how you add something onto it. <laughs> Especially when you're so focused on the other bits that you're like, oh, okay, I kind of forgot that bit. That's fine. That's good because this is quite a lot of blue here. So I like this. Again, I could have made a tab out of it, but I'm thinking of putting my three hearts on that tab. I know this is silly, but it's bothering me a bit that it doesn't look completely straight. I know. It doesn't really matter. Use my scissors, right? But there we go. Make sure this side's done too. Right. That I'm happier with. Okay. And yeah, the cat's ear did just go over that. Let's stick this back down. I'm just wondering, because I have this other little bit, I could put it here. could put it there, but let's have a look. So we've got these hearts. I was thinking of adding the hearts, because this will be my three of something. So that's that. So I need to be able to add the number. So we've got the heart. So if I put the wrapping paper underneath that, how would that look? Mm, I think I kind of like it. So let's do that. Again, I know I could have used this as the tab, but... I didn't. I wanted to use this tab up instead. So that's what I did. Okay. And we are going to use those hearts. Come on. Okay. Right. So we have a little bit more wrapping paper up there. And then we can use those hearts. They go really cute there as well. I'm going to put them a bit further down, right there. Maybe. That's cute. Okay, let's put these on. So that's my three of something. I almost feel like I want a bit more of this writing because it's just so beautiful. And I can add a little bit more maybe here. But I like all that leaf. What do I think? I think yes. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to add that. So I know the scraps for the... Um, wrapping paper are very small but that's okay they're still on there and it is what it is do i want another scrap of this paper like down the bottom here how would that look or over here yes i feel like i like it there so let's just, I had a pin on my glue. I have no idea where that pin went to. Oh, there it is. I've seen it. Okay, let's just do this top bit. Does it need it? Probably not. Are you saying it's too much? You could be right. I'm going to trim it. It's not completely dry yet. So if I don't like it. Oh no, I do. I like it. Just kind of fits on the bottom there. So now I need my pen. Oh dear me. Where's my pen gone? Here we go. 
and it's day, it's week 24. Week 24. Like so. Okay, guys, so let's check we've got everything. <laughs> oh, that cat's adorable. Something from the recycle bin. So we've got some packaging here with that cute cat. A bottle or glass. So we've got kind of both there. So well, it's a glass vase and a cute little pink glass. A piece of wrapping paper, which we've got there. A favourite food, raspberries. Yes, please. Uh, text in a different alphabet, which we've got here. I don't know if that's Chinese or Japanese. I apologise, but it's there. And then bonus three of something. So we've got three hearts. And actually, we've got three raspberries showing, but that wasn't um, on purpose, and the hearts were. So that's this week's index card, guys. That came together well and quickly. I hope you like this one. That cat is adorable. Oh, sorry if you're not a cat person this is definitely a cat channel I like cats and dogs but I'm more of a cat person um, I would have both if my older cat would let me but she's not going to so that's that um, and that's just cute I'm wondering actually I always feel like it's finished and then I come on I'm just going to round the bottoms I'm not going to round the top I'm just going to round the bottoms like that yes Okay, so that's this week's, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will be back again soon with next week's. Until next time, wherever you are in the world, I hope you're having lots and lots of crafty fun. Bye for now.